everybody we're back here it is officially i guess day two if you want to call it that of the actual racing we're here at south carolina motorplex uh we're getting ready for the next pass you can see here we've got all of our stuff laid out uh this is all in the car so we've got her unloaded and we're getting the car ready to go up and make a pass uh, we're gonna go with the same tune up from yesterday and uh, see if it'll turn a similar number it should and we'll go from there That should be it. We should be one and done. Uh, I know he's going to be extremely happy with that. That's a new personal best uh, for that car and for, and for Josh. Uh, so I think we're going to probably load up here and we'll head to the next track. Got over here. 
I think this is where oh, we're okay. going to end. I thought. All right. Here we are. Yeah, that's right. We are leaving. Got a little talking head here with me and the J Dogger. Entrance. Uh, yeah, I don't know where you go out. This is exit to the left and the right of that thing, but there's no like road. Uh, I think you turn around. All right, uh, back to the video. Sorry, but the bitching. <laughs> uh, um, so one and done. Uh, Five sixty. Five fifty-six. Five fifty-six. Yes. At one twenty-four. At one twenty-four. So one and done. Uh, today is, I, I don't know if this is normal. I don't think they normally do two tracks in one day. I don't think so. So we are now done at here. And we are heading on to Carolina Dragway uh, for the next track on the same day. Uh, hopefully that one is also a one and done. And then we are- we got like a 150 mile drive to the hotel. To the hotel. And we have to also stop and pick up uh, some wrenches. We want to check the fuel filter. We've got a, a fuel pressure dropping issue um, that, is, that seems to be happening so we're hoping maybe that's just a dirty filter or something like that so we'll pop the filter apart clean it dump it out and put it back together and see if that solves that so we are on our way to a, a, a AutoZone or a, a Riley's or something like that, yeah. right now so uh, we got a dog in the middle of the road stay over there buddy that was sad that was sad he had three legs, legs. Yeah. so he already got blasted um, so yeah, so we'll uh, hopefully we have a smooth, smooth ride, and we'll check in uh, along the way. South Carolina Motorplex is amazing. Badass that track works. Yes, badass. New personal best for this guy right here. With no change and nothing. No, no change. No suspension change. No, no nothing. Change, nothing. Yep. Identical to how it was yesterday. Just hooked and went. Yeah. So badass. So yeah. we'll check in. So just a little check in here. I kind of wanted to show you. So we're stopped at an auto zone. This is between where we just left, South Carolina Motorplex and Carolina Dragway. I kind of mentioned having the fuel pressure issues. So we stopped here at this auto zone and we took the fuel filter apart. Um, and what we found was on this here, on this area right here, there's a fuel filter that will slip over this. And the fuel filter sits inside this cavity. And the filter is just like a like a mesh uh, element. Well, that filter element had like some sticky, uh, like some kind of a sticky goo uh, in the element itself. So the we think that that is what was clog is clogging the filter and what is probably not helping with the fuel delivery. So. We, uh, we're here at the AutoZone, like I said, we, uh, my buddy's in here, Josh is inside, uh, cleaning that out, trying to get that as clean as we can. And I think the plan is once we get that cleaned out, we're just gonna throw it back in the car and we'll take off for Carolina Dragway. And hopefully that will solve the fuel pressure issues for today and hopefully for the rest of the event. And then he'll have to try to figure out, you know, where that uh, is coming from. So that's just check in. All right, we are pulling out. We are back on the road here in just a moment. Uh, fuel filter has been cleaned out and fingers crossed. We'll be at Carolina Dragway here, hopefully in just a little bit. Here. All right, checking in. We are at Carolina Dragway. Walter, fresh fuel filter-ish. Uh, we got everything unloaded as you can see here again. Uh, we got the tune pushed and we're gonna go up and make a pass. Hopefully this is one and done again. Uh, then we can get out of here. We've got a quite pretty healthy drive uh, up to Darlington. Plus there's a, bit of, a little bit of rain um, in the area and some rain at Darlington that's gonna come in tonight. So we're, because of the tires we're on, we gotta try to get to Darlington uh, tonight, hopefully, because the rain's gonna come in later tonight. So hopefully we're not trying to drive to Darlington in the rain, that wouldn't be ideal. So uh, we're gonna go up here and make a pass. Uh, so I'll show you that. Well, checking in with you, we are at the track. Unfortunately, right as we got here and got everything unloaded, as you just saw in the previous clip, uh, pretty much it started raining. <clears throat> so right now we're on a little bit of a weather delay. Um, I mean, it is what it is, it sucks, but it's part of the gig. So I think Josh is on his way back with the car to the pits. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and load up uh, important stuff in the car just in case it really lets loose. Right now it's kind of stopped and slowed down. 
they're trying to draw the track. I'm not sure exactly what's going to happen with that. So I think what happens is if, if they have to stop racing and not everybody can get a pass in, then I think they'll just throw out this slip. They won't take a slip for this race. So we'll see what happens. I'll check in with you. I'll let you know kind of what the what this, the situation is. All right. All right, here we go. First pass of the day. 